Hey everybody, Joe Lowry, what a day. Happy Monday to everybody. Happy Martin Luther King Day. If you had the day off, great. If you didn't like me, I had to do, uh, I had to put my eight hours in at work today. So uh, happy Monday to everybody. Uh, just in case you didn't know it, you can now find me at www.youtube.com slash Joe Lowry, what a day. We're now at 112 subscribers. I want to keep pushing the envelope, keep telling everybody about it. Let's get this show going. But hey, let's talk about it. what a weekend. Uh, football, football, football. I'll tell you, I mean, what about those Patriots? Uh, they did it. They came out flat, yes. They played poorly a little bit, yes. Yep, they still won. They're bringing on Pittsburgh. And, um, you know, in case you missed it, Antonio Brown started off the hype with Facebooking Live. All this while Coach Tomlin was addressing the team saying no social media. And there he is filming and uh, call it lack of discipline. But my Super Bowl pick is definitely the Patriots. I think they're going to take on Green Bay. It's the Revenge Bowl of 1996. And, of course, I'm going to pick Tom Brady, ring number five. That's right, ring number five. Also, Roger Goodell sighting in Foxborough this weekend. You never know what might happen. He was in Atlanta this past weekend. Uh, odds are he won't go down there again this weekend. So he might be coming to Foxborough. And if he does, if this all does pan out, what does Roger Goodell and Bob Kraft, what, what happens? What does Bob Kraft do? Does he welcome to the stadium? I don't know. It's going to be very, very interesting. But um, on a somber note, Yesterday, we all learned the passing of WWE Hall of Famer Jimmy Superfly Snuka. He passed away at 73 from complications of stomach cancer, and um, he was a childhood friend, uh, childhood idol of mine. Um, I did have the pleasure of meeting him a few times, and he was a pioneer of this great sport. Um, but, you know, this just adds to the list of legends that we've lost over the past year, including Rowdy Roddy Piper, the American Dream Dusty Rhodes, and, of course, uh, most recently, China and so forth. But, um... I guess I uh, came home tonight to an incredible meal prepared by Bubba and CJ, rice, beans, cheese, veggies. A heartfelt thank you for filling up the belly. I do appreciate that. It's always um, nice coming home to a freshly cooked meal. Um, a shout out to Lisa Kitty Cat McLeod. She's been under the weather for a couple of days. I hope she does get better. We're all rooting for you. Um, she's always on Facebook, so give her a shout out that she does get better. And um, I guess all eyes are on this Friday. That's right. President-elect Donald Trump's inauguration. They're talking about riots. They're talking about protests. I heard bikers for Trump are going to be there to protect him and so forth. And uh, just a lot of craziness, um, I think, taking place on what should be a celebration of our democracy. I'm going to leave it at that. I plan on doing more What A Days this week. Um, I'm planning on a, um, contemplating, I should say at this point, a Facebook Live show. Get my fans more interactive and so forth. I've had a lot of people ask me about that. And I'm really seriously thinking about doing that. A little bit nervous, but hey, you know, I'll do what the fans want. So, again, please share, spread, deliver, advertise, send emails, shout out from the rooftops, do what you got to do. Please visit me at www.youtube.com slash Joe Lowry. What a day. Subscribe. Tell all your friends. And that's it for now, folks. Joe Lowry. What a day.